Hey, what's up guys? Today we're making one of my favorite meals. I have it every motherfucking day, whether I'm trying to gain weight or lose weight. It's a skillet. You gotta listen naked. What do you need to make my skillet? First off, you need some fucking taters. I like this shit. They're simply potatoes. Like my dick, the ingredients list is very short. Oof. You're gonna need some steak. You need some eggs. You need some cheese. An onion. Green pepper. Salt and pepper. Hot sauce. So Here's what's hot. up. I love this green oh, Cholula shit. Baby. Lately I've been eating this new sweet habanero Cholula. It's very good. And you're gonna need some extra virgin olive oil. Only time virginity is fucking cool. Olive oil. <laughs> Before we get started, you know the rules. Step one. Pony up. Step two. Hammer time. Oh, oh. Step three, glove up. But Derek, why would you wear gloves? We're not using jalapenos today and therefore there's no threat of any pina wiener. Well, I like to waste money in a futile attempt to look cool and... All right, let's get cooking. First off, we're gonna cut up the uh, onion and the pepper and get those sweating. Sounds good. Lay down a little bit of fucking extra virginity olive oil. Oh. I don't know if that's a lot or a little, but... Baby! Give it the old razzmatazz. Stir that around, get it fucking in the oil or whatever helps it, I don't know. Remember, I'm not a fucking chef, I'm just a dude who eats food, so here we go. Okay. And I cover her up, let them sweat down. Next up, we're gonna get our taters going. We gotta preheat this shit, get some olive oil down. Uh, first up, it's two tablespoons, says so on the bag, so if you can't remember that. Well, that's warming up, let's go start the grill. Lay the taters. <laughs> Flatten them out. Tell you what, this pan here is perfect for these fucking, this bag of hash browns. It's at Target, it's like 20, 25 bucks. All right, I let the potatoes cook on this side for like five to eight minutes and maybe halfway through I give them a little spin. Probably bullshit, I think it helps. All right, the green peppers and onions are sweating, taters are down, time to prep our meat. Oh baby. So on my meat, I just go olive oil, salt, and pepper. Uh, most times I use sirloin, uh, but sometimes when I'm feeling a little bougie, I go tenderloin. My wife yells at me for the price, but you know, you pick your battle. Steak is one of mine. I will fight the fight. Really? Do you know how sirloin got its name? Apparently, a long time ago, a king of England knighted a steak, knighted a loin, and he called it sirloin. Stacy told me that, she learned it in culinary school. Hmm. Salt and pepper. Oh, gross. Oh, yeah. After I do my pointless fucking spin, I sold. Occasionally, I stir the uh, the onions and green peppers here. Naked. While all that's going, I shred up my cheese. I like to use pepper jack. Uh, this cheese here is RBST free. Ain't got a fucking clue what RBST is. <laughs> I like cheese. I'm a big cheese eater. A lot of people are afraid of cheese. Cheese is good for you. Eat your fucking cheese. Okay. All right, time to flip the hash browns. We lay another tablespoon of olive oil over it. Naked. And then uh, when you flip them, you let them cook for like a minute or two, and then you turn the heat down until they're done. Here we go. All right, once your grill gets to about 500 degrees, we lay the steak down. I usually cook it about Ow. five minutes on one side and four minutes on the other. Ow. That's right, I cook my steak. I usually try to hit about medium. Sometimes I fuck it up and it's medium well. That's okay, it's still fucking meat. I don't give a fuck about all you rare steak eaters. You guys are annoying as fuck. You're like the, the, the IPA bougie fucking people of the beer world. All right, the eggs. <laughs> I'm an egg eater, I love eggs. I eat the whole fucking egg, that means eat the yolk. Eat your yolks, the yolks are filled with good fats and a bunch of amino acids. Fuck all this egg white diet bullshit to get skinny. Ouch. Three eggs, three eggs a day. All right, this is the color I like on my onions and peppers and once it gets here, I just turn it down on low and let it just sit there until I'm ready. Once the hash browns are pretty nice and cooked on both sides, I just like to chop it up here and then I turn it on low and continue flipping it around until everything's done. Stacy and I disagree on what good hash browns are. I like mine nice and brown and crispy. She don't, but here we go. Time to flip our beat. Uh, well, once you grab your tongs, you gotta go ahead and give the old uh, one, two, three, make sure they work. Here we go. Here's a trick I learned recently from reading on the internet that I'm starting to do. When I flip the steak, I give it a little sear for a minute, and then I turn the, uh, the burners off that are under it, and it cooks in indirect heat. That's a word. All right, now in our eggs goes salt and pepper. Oh, yeah. Fucking beat him! Beat him! All right, everything here's done, so I go ahead and I just throw the uh, peppers and onions into the hash browns and give them a nice little stir. 
Okay, right before we start cooking the eggs, we lay some hash browns down in our skillet bowl. If you don't have a fucking skillet bowl, you need to go get one. Nice big bowl, check it out. If you're trying to be skinny, half a bag of potatoes. If you're trying to gain weight, one serving is one bag of potatoes. Don't be a fucking bitch about it. Layer of potatoes, mm. layer of cheese. Mm. Cheese, good. Or as soon as I throw the eggs down here, I just stir. I stir the eggs. You want your eggs to be kind of fucking a little wet. What's the word? Wet, runny, juicy, juicy eggs. You want juicy eggs. Overcooked eggs just don't taste as good. Eggs are done. Okay. Lay the eggs. More cheese. Mmm. All right, we're going to cut up our steaks. I cut them into little fucking squares. I'll tell you what, I'm not a gristle guy. I don't like too much Ouch. fat. Throw the steak down. Oh, yeah. More cheese. Yeah. And we hot sauce that son of a bitch. Oh, baby. Give her a stir. Mm. And there you have it. My skillet bowl. Yes, I eat this every day while I'm losing weight. Sometimes I eat it before bed. I like going to bed with a nice <laughs> full tummy. Uh, but if I eat it right now, what do I got for later? An extra steak, an extra serving of hash browns for before bed when I get hungry for snacks about 10, 10.30 every night. Thanks for watching Cooking with Derek White, guys. We'll catch you next week.